G'day guys, welcome to the wonderful world of Hyundai. So this is a little Gat, <laughs> which needs a radiator. Uh, and it, that's, that's it there. <laughs> Why am I making this video when I actually never, uh, I never, I never did the job. So my mechanic surprised me and pulled it all apart. Uh, we're flat out today. I don't want to start making videos with all the cars here on a Friday, but you can see here the crash bars come out. Uh, you can see he's plugged the trans lines there the issue with this car was that the front of the car had a crush in it uh, and we've pulled it out so this is a composite material of what's like metal fused with plastic pretty neat so uh, the condenser's been replaced because it was impacted um, you could see that there and that's a little note whenever you buy a car I mean I forgot years ago myself I bought a Alpha that was V bent in the front always have a look under the grill pull the clips out and just see if the car's been crushed because it's literally what I don't know 10% of cars have this bent condenser and a lot of the times the condenser doesn't leak uh, like it, this car's air conditioning was actually working like that so that's the little gets you can see here I hope this helps someone who knows what they're doing if you know what you're doing you don't need to actually be told more than this oh <laughs> that's very easy to do um, yeah so that's it there there's the power steering oil cooler you can see you need to disconnect that this car also will have a headlight uh, bracket that was cracked here that we're going to fuse back together with super glue and baking soda um, and this gives you a good indication of the job I don't know where he's put the headlights probably in the trunk um, I don't know where the headlights are but you can see the mounting points of the headlights very clearly on the bracket here and possibly here. So bar off, power steering off, bonnet cable, bonnet catch mechanism. Um, and I oh, never disconnected the battery in the end. Great, because with the 1212 code discovery system, uh, sometimes it's not so easy to get the code. You've got to pull the radio out and look at the serial number, add 1212 to it. So, well, you don't have to dis disconnect a battery on a car. It's best not to. You can see here, the main thing about this, do you need to lose the gas as a normal sort of person doing this? Do you need to lose the gas? I don't know. It looks like it. It certainly looks like it. Most cars, the condenser swings out of the way. It's looking here like you've got to lose the gas. It's all fixed. It's quite nicely done, actually. Um, obviously, they took the German engineers many more years uh, earlier than I thought they did. There's a Volkswagen-style connector there. Um, so, yeah, that's the job. There's the power steering there. I was trying to work out where the cooler is. Sorry, that was a trans... Sorry, guys. No, it was a power steering cooler. There they are, there. There's the bolt, there's the hoses for the oil cooler that's fixed there. So condenser, radiator, you can see the bottle and the fans have been replaced on in situ. Okay. So that's that. Nicely done, Hyundai. <laughs> Hope that helps, guys. Bye.